You want me to? Hey everyone, Koi Maizu here, and welcome back to World of Horror. I played this about a month ago, and I want to come back to it for a while. I haven't played it since then, though. I was really bad. My, well, I wasn't bad. I wasn't bad at it. I mean, I, I beat the stages I was supposed to be doing, but I think I died immediately after doing what I was supposed to be doing. But I think... Like, I think I'm, I'm good to just go quick play, right? I am just to start a random play there. Jetpack Town. Yeah, yeah, we get it. This channel the mission a long time ago, Gozo, has found a way to use mirrors to ensnare and teleport its prey straight to reflective glass. But this is behind your reflections are just the beginning of a real nightmare. Old gods rule, resting at home, raises doom. Backstar World of Horror, cards exclusive per cards only. Okay, there's me. Looks just like me. Um. Oh, okay, I already seen all this. Uh, so, let's remember what to do. I guess we gotta go home and get a board thing. Okay, yep. Yeah. I just hear this on. I think this looks cool. Looking good. Looking good. Learn a new spell, like spell evil. Oh, that's when I first started. Nice movie poster. That's open, which I don't trust in this game. It's completely different, but hey, I like it. Investigating mystery. Uh. That's actually pretty rare to not see anything weird out here. So, 1984, my favorite year. The start of the mystery. Next week, more morbid events have been played in your town. You've marked five of them. So, let's see. Jeez, five endings? We gotta see five. Harbor memoir of Mor Morbid Mermaids. The gender is obsessed with mermaids. Collect every scrap of legend about them in the school basement. Oof, okay, this is gonna be creepy. <laughs> I was mind is snapped. He's decided it's time to make one of his own using unfortunate student bodies as materials. Creepy! Okay. There's one thing everyone in this school is talking about. Another girl from the area has gone missing. Could there be anything connecting all these many people? Let's rescue downtown next. Do I have money? I have four. You gotta need uh, cool items real quick so I don't die. Uh, equipped. There you go, we got a little steak knife. Shut up, takes precious time to put four doom. Let's go investigate downtown then. I just wanted a weapon. That way, uh, wasn't reaching for straws in a fight. The only metro line in your town connects to university and science complex. You could take a ride to gain some time, but you have a feeling something's wrong. Where are the people? Look, check sets. Even though the metro car is completely empty, you're at your station without any problems. Saving valuable time, minus two doom. Easy. Uh, let's get the seaside location. With quest, ask our neighbor got you some results and the other girls at the same school. Costumes into recruit allies slash learn gossip. Okay. What's my doom at right now? 3%. Learn some gossip, I guess. Well, because I don't think they're gonna want to be on my side. Okay, they're staring at the class today. They look like heads, they look fine. Yeah, I don't know about this computer program that. Yep, leave me on a cliffhanger. Oh! Whoa! 
Oh, no. I wasn't expecting someone to actually join me. Heck yeah. Dorian looks around. Did you hear? Never mind. Okay, I got a friend. You know, horror manga about spirals. You, who's a maki? They seem relaxed. A bit weird they seem relaxed reading it, but you know. Dorian's such a kidder. You're reading Uzumaki. Join me. Let him since he came back. All right. He's the type where my entire name starts to taste weird. Almost like, just in and off. Okay. I did get one. That's enough for me to be happy. I, I wasn't expecting to get anyone, if I'm being honest. What is... Has to spell. Forget spell. I guess we won't use it. Go whispers. Clap. Wow. And then we probably alone. Set up telescope. I don't have a telescope. Uh, wait. So let's just leave. Let's get to school. I have a friend and everything now. I feel powerful. But the trail going code might be time for a different approach. Could be could a similar case have occurred in the past? Church the library might be a good idea. Yeah, study issue of local newspapers. Not check failure. It was a complete waste of time. You spent the whole day reading about cute dogs, giant vegetables, and the occasional accent. That never is the case ten. Ah. All the Mr. Girls are apparently members of the swimming team. Maybe we can never saw someone stalking. We just keep on investigating, right? We stumble upon the computer room. This is a good opportunity to check the school's database. Look right that might help your investigation. Oh my gosh! So, uh, with rising, where you discover that you're in. Oh wow, you found a curious photo saying photos. You find you're in everyone. And last question was a man smiling over your bed. That's horrifying. And this. <laughs> that lowered my reasoning, which makes sense. That's just on the school computer. Oh, I gotta go home. <laughs> you found a written notebook, handwritten detailed notes about the swimming club and mermaids. Travel to morbid school. Before we go to the morbid school, can I get some library studying in? I can make notes. Here are a few books in the main room, so I have to make some notes about subjects that be relevant in this case. Hopefully, your work won't go to waste. And... Interpreting the old truth, you learn a new spell. Skin removal! Oh, wow. Uh, deal six damage, cost three reason. How does my skin coming off hurt someone? They don't want to see it? Good. Uh, let's go to Morbid School. Investigate Morbid School. A nauseating stench stops you. Someone has scattered rotting fish guts everywhere and hung up countless fish heads. Cover your mouth as you slowly retreat. A vast of flocks, a vast flock of seagulls just attack the windows. That's not good. Someone has marked a pad leading from the sea directly to the school building. We can never make scene of your Valence. That's not that we find a plan to the sewer system. Okay. Something is wrong, you don't see anyone around here. We've had this one, but it just kind of messed me up. I have my friend. Isn't she with me still? I still have student C. Doi. What's so wrong here with Pat's defect? We don't see. You have to deal with it alone. I have her. She's like right there. She's walking with me. <laughs> oh, your path is blocked by a rotting corpse covered in poison ivy. Just like that. Okay, we're in it. Uh, to do. I remember I do this a little bit. It's a firearm. I don't have a gun. Um, you attack with just a chance to hit, or your allies to attack. Two damage. Fire attack. I remember like preparing and the strong attack, and then weak attack's pretty good to do. I think that's about like all I can do though when that happens. And I don't think my friend automatically attacks. Whoa! Who touch on? Back to you. Uh you you get a little hit in. We'll both hit. Miss the attack? But I got him. Hit you with a vine.
Might work. I mean, well, I did take something, so... Okay, for the most part. Compare the sewer plan with the school map and it suddenly dawns on you. School basement, that must be the place where the kidnapper is keeping the missing swimmers. Okay. You carefully into the biology classroom. The room seems empty at first, and so you switch the lights on. You gasp in horror, you're lying in the pool of blood as one of the teachers with a fruit knife in their hand. There's a jar of formaldehyde in the, on the nearest table. Mesmerized by the spiral pattern on the sea's creature's skin, you step over the dead body and come closer. And then the voices start. Oh, forgotten specimen? I'm finding a jar with a state knife. <laughs> a fast combat for the duration of this counter if they'll lose a random ally are you i don't want to i don't want to lose you <laughs> oh i can learn about my enemy let's do that so i can special kill weak against blunts that makes sense i inventory slash myself uh, but I just, I have nothing blunt. It's almost dead anyway, like, it, it, it's not very strong. Pick it up! Wait, what's that? <laughs> I've got a lump of flesh! <laughs> I'll just casually grab that out of the living jar creature. <laughs> I'm sure back now, God, let's hope she's alright. You bust through the door into the janitorial closet, but it's already too late. The ladies and some girl is lying on a dirty mattress, her upper torso at least. A tail of fish has been crudely sued in place of her legs. She was too weak and died. You're the mad janitor, say. You're the mad janitor, say. Oh, he said she was too weak and died. Oh, God, she's here. He looks you up and down and says, maybe you'll do. Oh. I can go to the previous video. This journey has found another spirit. Person body is to experiment on you. Okay. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> What's this lump of flesh? Eat it. Oh god. What did I just do to myself? Why did I eat the lump of flesh? That was not a good idea. Okay, wait. I use skin removal as well. Oh, it takes their skin off. That's a way cooler. Don't worry, ally. Just stand back and let me handle this. I miss. Wait, so what does this one do really quickly? Next stack is additional chance to hit. Well, it has an auto. Wait, so it'd be better to like prepare strong this and that. I missed him. He's gonna kill me. Take his skin. I can't die here. I can't die here. We're good. Oh! Wow, I was I was killing him way. I was not paying. I gotta start paying attention to health. I was just kind of focused. I don't know what kind of happened to me. I mean, I feel like I came out far worse than what he was trying to. Well, he was gonna kill me and just put fish legs on me. But like, I I have to go home like this now. Maybe that's gonna scare away the creep that was in my house. Uh, Matt Jenner's buying some support. Pick up his axe and using it as a crutch. You try to leave the room. Engine and weaken. You slowly lose consciousness in the corridor. Post office find you a few hours later. No, she said Matt Jenner's found. She sleeps a little better knowing that the other students are safe. Ending A. Knowledge is key, plus their experiments, there is still hope, minus three doom, tireless for some reason, and time passes. Cosmos has been mortified when they saw me. You know, this is... I, I don't know why, but I'm kind of into this look a little bit. That might sound weird, but there's something mildly attractive about it. Anyway, you don't have to know that. Uh... I got a fire axe. An excellent melee weapon. Let's go. Hey, um, my friend, you're still with me? Okay, well, I, <laughs> okay, you give me plus one perception, so I guess kind of if you have allies, they're useful just as for passive quirks. So 
so you I you help me see better. You kind of just hide behind me during combat at all times. Oh god, sirs. The opposing shadow cast by Allah is getting longer each day. Heart of darkness. Oh good. Inside your find a small key. You grab that. I look normal there, but trust me, that's just how I imagine myself before I look in the mirror and relive it all over again. Uh, shower will help you calm down. Do wonders for your sore muscles. What temperature should you set it to? Plus one stamina. Bizarre roots of the blood curdling botanists. Oh god. We need rescue to help. Husband Shiro san has gone missing. He's worried he might be connected with a new fertilizer he ordered from Tokyo. Where is he and why would he need so much fertilizer? We started a new mystery. Bizarre of the blood curdling botanists. Okay. Uh Some XP. You know, I love my XP. I, I didn't have expel evil. Can I just. Oh, it costs my stamina. I won't use it now then. I look really horrifying in a way. Like, I, I think everyone's just kind of cool with me looking like this, though. So, like, you know, it's quite accepting, really. I already spell. This is. Okay, I don't know how this game works. I'm sure pros are like screaming at their computers and are making really dumb choices. Um, I have no idea. Does Doom get to 100 and then something bad happens? I'm assuming that's how it works. I, I don't know why I'm asking, but like, I'm assuming that when it gets to 100, something bad happens. Boy, that sounds fun. Ignore the current event and instantly investigate a random other world event. One time use only. I'd rather not. I, I'm cool with my event. Can we help you? Um, I guess you can't. Oh, oh, well, that's cool. How much I can do there? Let's just go investigate downtown. Seeing the two chopped heads, you can't but wonder who's been preparing your food for the past week. Who's some altier? Cops! Uh, the nearest going to the officer about the group's discovery. The policeman's great one gives you a small reward. Thank you. I'm trying to get this town better. We can't just be okay with seeing this down the street. You go down the street, it's just a child inside out walking and laughing, and we're just cool with it. And I, I know that saying how I look, but still, this can't be normal for us people. We need to make a change. Anyway, what's up, dog? Uh, I don't have anything in my slot B, I believe. Like, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Addictive. <laughs> I'm okay. Give me the camera. Nice! Jerthon's always been a weirdo, but he's good at what he does. Last month he ordered a pack of an experimental fungicide from Tokyo. He look, help me move this dirt and I'm looking for it. Okay. Walking through the park, you find a little girl crying alone in the playground. When you ask her what's wrong, she says that she can't find her mommy. Luckily, spot the girl's address on the back of the clearing nearby. Let's go home! Uh, you offer to take her home. When you get there, the terrified mother slams the door in your face. Remind the door starts screaming to get the girl away. The girl calmly takes, tells you that she can take it from here. Oh, wow. And that kind of also gave my XP, but it hurt me. <laughs> I just delivered a, a child to kill her mother. Man. Uh, dispatch order is stained with a foul smelling liquid. You think you can make out the address? These parts of it. House is nearby somewhere in the forest. Somewhere in the nearby forest. Oh, 
know. I don't know what just happened, but I just got enough experience to level up. Real quick. Do I get some charisma? Yes, yeah, just one. Got you. Charisma. And let me not. Oh, I have to choose. Oh, there's also perks here. Um, Additional damage against ghosts and out your enemies. Plus one luck. Plus one knowledge. That one sounds cool. I like second sight. And... Reason's really important because it's hard to build back up. But like stamina, I'm going to get to a boss fight soon. So maybe I should keep that one. I'm okay. The Shroud's in the bend and Shido, Shinto Shrine is overgrown to steep. However, it could be in a place... Please first get quick route. We don't need that slow stuff. Strength check. Yeah, I know how it is. Because you're in a hurry, you hike to the hilltop, burn burnt out candle wax and dry blood around the shrine. I mean, a new sinister cold is location. Oh, we should probably get out of here then. <laughs> it's dark room, the church is growing so close to each other. Nothing. Got you. I'm just, there's nowhere really I can know where to go. I'm just kind of wandering. That uh, famous priest down this rock. Let me get that power. Now let's check success. Touching it with your hand, you feel a newfound. Let's go. Things go my way. What's what's like it? Flesh regrowth. Use it. I'll take that. I'll take it. Uh. This the dirt road you suddenly followed. The dirt road you've been following suddenly ends. You have to go back. This left one. Let's see if there's anything here. One bumps into you as she runs from a beauty parlor. Before you can say anything, you notice her face. She's carved out her own eyes. I... I can't see it. She cries. It, it can't see me, alright? You shudder, seeing a faint vision of Gozo reflecting in the beauty parlor's mirror. Well... She's... Uh, how about down here? To the rip flesh? This just group you've been following is kind of the nearby forest. They're enacting some sort of ritual in a clearing up ahead. The only nearby bench points a large rock. I don't have ritual rope, so we're gonna try to climb that. And we hurt ourselves. Limp away. This one? Do I have to find all these or do I just have to be lucky to find the right one? Uh, while wandering the forest, you saw strange carvings on the trees and by uh, the look of them, they were made recently. Can they be connected? I a picture. I have a camera, right? You take a picture of carvings to compare them to various sources at home. Makes more sense. This one. Dropping, drooping tree branches hang over the path, filling in an almost macabre way. Uh, it's almost inspiring. You get lost in the thoughts. Uh, you get completely lost in your thoughts. You wander around the woods for a long time, but you sure you have some new leads in your investigation. The plus XP. I'm getting really lucky right now. Uh, this one. Oh, a shape simmers beneath the surface with a splashy sound. Something emerged from the murky depths. You take a photo with flash orienting the enemy. That was automatic. I love that. Um, so I can't do what I used to do. I can just do prep and strong attack now. Which, is that all the best thing I can do? I'll learn about them. Uh, strangled by her jealous girlfriend, she became food for leeches. Now they are looking for a new host. Random chance of losing additional health. We can get fire. That I do not have, but she is going to die in this next turn, so we're ready. <laughs> Man, I'm just, I'm a boss. I mean, I'm kind of going insane, but if that happens, I'd lose, but you know, I'm, I'm, I'll manage. <laughs> Discover an old campsite located on the edge of a small clearing. Tin has been knocked down, the food and utensils have been scattered everywhere. Investigate! Or clues. Uh, footprints and tracks just to fight. The owner of the tent must have been dragged up by two unknown attackers into the woods. Experience, yay! Uh, Stump on a happy and dear carcass. Lovely. Abandoned huts. Finally, after what felt like hours falling the road. Wow, was, the, was it the middle one or is that is that random? And it was just the middle one. I went through every other thing. <laughs> falling the roof on an old mansion. It's overgrown with plants you've never seen before. In front of the mansion, there's the gardening company. Minivan filled with boxes. Slowly, instant burden with caution. 
You stand in the middle of the room when suddenly the floor gives way and you fall down to the basement. Going through the hole in the floor, you would find yourself in an overgrown basement. In the corner lies a man you recognize. It's Shiro-san, the missing gardener. You must help him escape this cursed place. First second, you must protect the injured Shiro-san and leave him to safety. Then you lose health each turn. Wait, what are you? Oh, okay, you're all, I only have these. Um. Oh! That? Oh my... I'm killing it right now. I'm so glad I had the fire axe on me. I just chopped it out and had carried him on my back. Uh, let's continue to attack as you and the gardener flee from the forest and then suddenly stop when you reach the city limits. You must call an ambulance from a phone booth but lose consciousness before it arrives. Wake up in the hospital, your wounds treated. I'm always passing out. Uh, when asked about Shiro, San, the doctors are puzzled. The only person they found, the gardener is missing. Really? Uh, bizarre brood of the blood curdling botanist. Or I couldn't even save him. I was I actually really want to save him. What do I tell his wife? Uh, yeah, what do I tell the wife? I, I had him. And then guess what? I just woke up and he was gone. Like, she's not going to take that. She probably is. No signs are baffled. Unprecedented aura like events bathe the entire town in unnatural green glow. I probably shouldn't do anything with a lighthouse yet, right? Powerful saga of the Moonlight Sailors. Uh, it began with one fisherman who dragged something truly awful from the belly of the ocean, a dark writhing ooze that mesmerized them beyond control. He hid himself away for a week, adoring it, not to be seen until one moonlight night, when a young girl spotted his boat drifting away, a single lantern swinging at the helm, and the captivated fisherman singing eerily to this catch. Now more and more fishermen have begun to find the vile ooze in their nets, and one by one, they are disappearing. Then the ocean will take them all. I am going to kill the Kraken. Let's just investigate. Suddenly, an empty bottle smashes on the wall behind you. Put yourself in the glass fragments and notice a mass sailing holding a baseball bat. I'm just gonna be honest with you, this is really not gonna go well for you. You, you went up to the one person holding a fire axe. Um, this is gonna hurt. So let's get started. You 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 completely took this on yourself. I'm letting you know that. I'm trying to see. Can I do anything else in my turn? Or five bounds. I can assess the enemy. I probably should do that first. So let's assess the enemy, prepare to attack, and a strong attack. We can sharp. I have something very sharp. Ow. Ow. She hit me hard. <laughs> One of the many to serve people. Okay. Yeah, y'all, I got something that's going to serve you just well. So you stay right there. You're very lucky you're alive right now. I'm telling you that right now. <laughs> that's what I'd say after cutting her head off. Wait, what's that? Prescription. I love prescriptions. Drug prescription. Expensive pharmacy drugs. You mean I can have drugs? Uh, sweet. So, where do I get my drugs? To the hospital. I, I wouldn't mind also getting wait, patient Lisa some time for you to the office. How are we doing, guys? Uh, emergency character is crowded as a result of the weird things happening in your town. You find the rest. Now, how can I help you today? Wait, help me. <laughs> Please. No, doctor. I also have this drug prescription. I got off this lady I hacked and, and so she stopped moving. You gotta help me. Painkiller. I'll, I'll just take your painkillers. That works too. Let me just chug those right quick. Appreciate it, Doc. Love you. Uh, important document. So this is just like a document thing that I'm not gonna be able to use. That's fine with me. Oh, you have the stench for hours. You clean nothing besides that the fisherman had a wife. Perhaps you pay her a visit. Go. Oh. 
Alarmed by the sound of glass breaking, you discover the corpse of a policeman lying in a pool of blood. It looks like someone or something toward his throat. Oh, let me get the gun. Let me get the gun. <laughs> oh, crap. Won't be needing for sure, but you still feel bad about stealing from a corpse. I really don't. The game kind of put that on me. I'm completely fine with it, but it is kind of making me go insane. So let me try to think of a way I can live. My fire axe is better than a gun. Plus, oh wait, no, plus damage was shot nine. Wait, this one has to be better, right? I'll hold it for now. When you're at the fish mouse stands long vacated, peering through the dusty window, you recoil and shot. I'm losing it. Is there anywhere I can go to help me? Overgrown garden, it's fine. We don't need help. Oh, did I just die? Corpses are struggling with wires. Like, I think I just died. You will die at the beginning of your next encounter. Wait, how am I alive right now? What? It just. That castle was found on shore. Your mind is snapped. You've been locked in the highest asylum. It would be comforting to accept that you were insane and no old god is awaking uh, devour humanity. But the drugs have made those horrors disappear. I tried. <sighs> we're not done yet. We're gonna go again. Uh, I, I feel like I know this game now. Like, I, I feel like at this point, I know, I understand this game. So let's go this one. So we haven't done this one. Horrible history of household hell. There are many old mansions around this town. Zero, zero, zero Manor is one of them. Supposedly haunted by a family of four who disappeared without a trace one summer. But is it the only tra tragic event that took place there? Friend, friends you've talked with are not sure where the mansion itself is located. Let's find the mansion first trip to the library and shed some light. Really quickly, can I go shop for... Uh, you got something good, my friend? Yeah, thank you. I, I just need something where I can kill people, if you understand. Wait, it's so like, you just want me to investigate the school? Here's the kitchen, even though the band lights are out, something's cooking in the large, probably don't like the smell of it. I have a weapon, um, which I, I'm sure in the kitchen you're gonna get a knife, which I have a knife already. The first aid? No. The building was supposed to be somewhere near the cliffs. You copy the mansion's photo from the newspaper and prepare to leave. Uh, hey, police, you know, I just make crap. You can't patrol downtown? Nope. Thanks, officers. Just want to see. When you turn metro car, I notice an oddly shaped package on the seat up to you. Smart with your name, you reach for the package, but hesitate. An icy feeling settling into your stomach. Whoop -ah. As soon as you pick it up, you realize that you are holding and dropping it in horror. Well, I'm, at least I dropped it. You will need a strong rope to end the mansion with a high window. Bring different mansions with the sketch, you finally find this one. There's only one problem. Hmm. Yeah, like rope. I get a Yakuza card. The town stacks are a mix of modern warehouses, small shops, and bars with alternative crowd gathers. Alternative crowd gathers. <laughs> An ancient wooden temple occupies a small hill at the top of the thing. Look for a job. Well, I got money. That, that upgrades my doom by like four right there. I, I, I was looking at that. Give me that. I kind of, I'm pretty much broke now, but uh, make it the window. This is the better message friends have talked about. Uh, 
Uh, that pair has been followed you since morning. You finally managed to lose them, but you can't shake the feeling that it'll only get worse. Brutal. Okay. You heard a weird noise come from the lock study. You must find a key. And we're doing the same thing as we did before. Let's go through the overgrown garden. There's a local legend about a heartbroken seamstress. Uh, one stormy night, she broke into a local inn, stitched the unsuspecting guests together. How do you do that? You just start running around, sit, no one fought back? They're finally with some artwork. That's just a legend, right? Let's check out the sewing machine. Oh, God. Yeah, shouldn't have checked that out. She, she didn't even do anything to me. My health was already like that from the those couples following me. She didn't do anything to me. Shouldn't check her out though, but I was curious. So watch. I know I'm over time, so we gotta run. Okay, things aren't going super well for me here, if I'm being honest with you. You enter the art workshop. The room is cluttered with half finished sculpture and a bizarre mask hanging on the wall. Once sculpture strikes, he was eerily realistic. One mask looks similar to the design you once saw on a cult book, so I take it with you. Put it on! Oh, well, we look a bit weird, but um, it's, it's just a mask, right? It can come off easy. Yeah, yeah. They look cool, in a way. Take a bath. <laughs> hey, wow, wow, that just gives, that's actually really good. It just permanently gives me strength. Okay, we, we found where we're supposed to go. In the middle of a room, you see a man tied to a chair. You rush in to help when you remove his... But you rush in to help. When you move his gag, though, the man starts shouting curses and ancient prophecies. You fall onto the floor. Your mind flooded with unspeakable images as the man slowly stands up, completely ignoring the chair you're seemingly tied to. Alright. You don't scare me necessarily. Not too bad, anyway. <laughs> Listen to the rambling is something I can do? You might try that. Hmm. Let's listen to a bit of his rambling. And then hit him over the head. <laughs> Learn your spell. <laughs> I just listen to a bit of his rambling. And I'm like, hmm, that's interesting. And then bash him in the head with the hammer. Oh, God. Oh, that seems like something I wouldn't want. Uh, I got a spell. Plus one knowledge of scarred on use costs four reason. Yeah. I don't need all that reason. Oh, that wasn't that wasn't the right area to go to. So me and you are still stuck wandering. You find a heavy tome wrapped in moth-eaten black velvet in an old looking cabinet. Remove the book's wrapping. Your coin discuss is bound to human flesh. I'll take it. Uh, Grandpa, you cut up on a rusty nail, driven to the corner. It just get it just gave me. Um, wow, that's pretty good. It just gave me plus 10 XP. Like, no bad things, just plus 10 XP. I probably should just grab it, or read it right then there instead of taking it, because it made me cut myself. Uh, here. You aren't sure what to expect. The sturdy door to the study opens the creek. The darkness of the room's empty, but something goes wrong. I think draft, perhaps. You move the rotten carpet aside to reveal a passageway directly into the cliff rock. Following a strange song, you discover a hidden passage that leads you to an underground chamber connected to the sea. You can't find the source of the sounds, but then it hits you. The acoustics of this place makes the waves sound like the beautiful, like the most beautiful serenade. Mesmerized, you step close to the stone altar at this end of the room. Tracks for the dark corners is too dark, but only got some light. I don't have a flashlight or anything. Wait, what? 
Unholy chants coming from the caves connected to the mansion must have driven the family insane. But eventually, the outside world they fed on what they had themselves. However, they're playing the fresh corpses and wet tracks around the altar. What was the ending C? I guess if I had a light, I'd be able to see what else was around the area. But I didn't have that, so I, it was kind of ended. Well, I mean, that's not the worst ending. We didn't die or lose our mind or like become a demon. You know, that, 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 that's just a mask. So that's well, not too bad. I think dog disappeared last night. Let's find a new. What? No! The dog! Oh my gosh. That's why I hate this place. Cutting a big octopus. This is what she claims. There are way too many tentacles. Hmm. Eerie episode of Evolving Eels. <laughs> I'll turn to your house and someone suddenly bumps into you. Did you know? You turn around. Your friend lives in the same apartment complex. Kind of. That weird dude is back. You know, the one who studies fish. You shrug, opening the door. Kind of follows and immediately enters the kitchen. A while later, she returns with two cans of soda. Oh, it's a good girl. <laughs> Aren't you curious what weird fish did he bring this time? She grins. Sure, kind of. <laughs> Um, I saw the creepy neighbor carrying some jar inside his apartment. I wonder where fish did he find this time. Will you check it out? He will surely recognize me if I try to do it myself. Please? Sure, Kana. Knock on your friend's door and wait. Hey, dork, I'm with you while we're going to my place. Oh, sorry. I didn't, I, I didn't realize you were my only friend. <laughs> just walk back to her house. Like, you can go. You can stay here. So, oh, I have just Kana on my side. Uh, receive... Wait, what? Friend neighbor important. Receive minus one damage from it. Wow, thank you, Kana. That's quite nice. That smiles faintly. Love you too. I have a friend. Mr. Ooh, your neighbor's a horror manga artist. He shouldn't come up with a new satisfying ending for his new story. What's that picture? Shit. Yeah, you wanna hear my story? Incredible. You should have been excited, man. How do you come up with this stuff? Sending the sword would be a huge hit. Paid you a token of appreciation. He took my XP from me. He threw two gold coins at me. That sucks, actually. Yeah, I was gonna level up soon. Dude's working at school, right? We should break to his office. What do you mean we shouldn't? It must be empty because he just came back and his classes begin next week. Sure, can we find a friend? Does anybody want to join me? This comes close since last week. Come on, pigtails. Join us. Come on. Okay, no, okay. Heard you. Heard you. I got student F. You wanted to come too? No, got you. Uh All right, Kana. Uh, let us go around the school. We still have to bring to this guy's office. Let's see what's in here. Uh, she said he, she would do everything to be with you, even meant to cheat death itself. Oh, goodness. Soccer girl. I have a soccer? Uh, I can tell <laughs> with my beautiful face. <laughs> it's, um... Where... Where's my assess button? Set situation, we're an attack, strong attack, and then we move back. Girl so in love with you, she killed herself in a ritual to bond you together. Why are you hurting me then? <laughs> I was trying to see if there was a way to talk to her. It's not love. Maybe just a sick way of it, actually. Just stop <laughs> bashing her to death with a hammer. What was that? Found an occult diary. Uh, use three doom. Get out of here. Sweet. That's actually really good. The neighbor's office at school is empty. You did. You do find a few jars off with weird eel-like fish. Despite your protest, kind of says take one jar home. Kind of. Why would you do something that dumb? You know what type of town we live in. There's random eldritch horrors, demons, abominations just walking around. There's, there's a guy who just took pictures of some girl anytime she slept and she found it at a school computer and you're taking anything from this town home? 
Oh, I love her, but she's such an idiot. Have you ever seen an evil like this? It's so freaky. Did you ever feel like it's watching us? How can she super soda so calmly? You know, I'm really... I thought about this for a while, and I do think I'd be better with other friends. <laughs> As you prepare a bad thing about all the possible leads so far, their tires seems ice cold water is a good idea. Sure. Here's your success, and I leveled up! Ice water uh, revitalizes you and you're ready for the investigation. Let's see. I'll go stamina. And dexterity. Oh. Parting gifts. Oh, letting allies go. Uh, like this would have been useful if I kept that girl. Maybe I should have kept her because if I let her go, ah, that's fine. Additional spell slots. I'll reroll. These are okay. Completing a mystery grants a range spell. Third rounds during combat is more effective. Sure, let's we'll go that one. And stamina, I'm good. I've seen him burning some notes behind our apartment building. Let's go and check it out. Is this eel even alive? You hear rustling on the other side of your apartment door. Someone's trying to get in. Kinda, this is what we're dealing with. This is what, I mean, honestly, I don't know who's here. <laughs> this is what we deal with on a normal basis and you thought it was a good idea to take something home from doing this. His attacks can randomly cause concussions. Oh, I just freaking learned how. I have tiny cuts and concussion. Huh, that's not too bad, actually. He just made me dumber. That's how hard he hit me. Oh, wait, yeah, wait. I should do this, 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 and then this. I might as well make sure my other one lands no matter what, right? Like, this is, I do that a lot. Uh, you defeated up the apartment stalker. Pick it up. A baseball bat. I mean, it's probably useless to me, if I'm being honest, because it's... I'm like no bower right now. I quite like it. Uh... So, you know, I'm good. I was right. Someone tried to burn some papers. They must have been in a hurt. Oh, or notes. Uh, because some papers look soluble. But return to your apartment try to decipher the notes. That's so weird. Your neighbor really was into eels, it seems. I guess I wonder if spying your neighbor was a good idea to begin with. This is, I cannot tell what this is like at all. Legend from the Prefecture Eels tells of a small village of robbers who would kill all visitors and dump their corpses into a lake of eels. Eels of the perfect you something would lay their eggs inside humans. Interesting. So I can just, I'll probably just put that in my storage, right? There's, well, I'll keep it, just in case I'll, I'll use it sometime. Let's uh, keep looking around my apartment. Find an envelope lying on a pillow in your bedroom. Inside is cash. I know for someone who's been watching you. I wish you luck in your test. I promise to meet you soon. Just how this happened in the bedroom. Okay. That is in no way comforting, so I'm completely fair with that loss reason. There must be something we can learn. I'll try to bring it to his apartment tomorrow morning. I wonder what he's hiding in there. He shrugged not committedly. You just wish you could throw this dang jar in the trash. Just do it. She's not gonna stop me. <laughs> I'm sorry, I have this demon mask and I'm... <laughs> I have a hammer, like, I'm sorry. He's not doing much to me. Uh, my dog! He goes to the hardware shop. Anything of interest? I have nothing in... Oh, well, I do have that. Oh, I didn't, I didn't mean to... Wait, oh no, I, I didn't buy that. Wait, did I? No, I didn't. I thought I did for a second, but I guess not. So, let's have that. And all the normal stuff. Uh, so we'll go here. I probably didn't have enough money. 
Oh no, I did buy it. Uh, suddenly the air around you begins to swirl. Uh, ooh, wind. Brace yourself. Hey, sweet. That's it. You leave the beach quickly. That's all I experience. Thinking how stupid it is. Thinking about how stupid it is of Connor to try to sneak and break your neighbor's house. You go to sleep. Just take a nap. Um. So I can move this to storage. I don't need to have all this storage. I can sell it actually. Let's sell it. I have no need to do it. Uh, keep that. I'll sell my steak knife as well. I'll grab my shovel. And I'll keep my carpenter's axe actually. I'd like to keep that if you don't mind. Wait, trade trade this out. Thank you. And send that one in your storage. Awesome. Let's investigate Seaside again. You spent an entire day waiting for Kana. Where is she? Oh crap, Kana, where did you go? Come on. I have a shovel. Crabs are feasting. What is that? Who's that? Oh, okay, never mind. Mr. for the body, you're talking about crabs don't want to share their meal. I gotta attack my crabs. So like he's watching from the sea? Hmm. I keep on investigating the wrong place. I. <laughs> That's on me. I gotta look at this circle. <laughs> hmm. This you enter. Well, this sucks because I know what this does because we did it in the first thing. Ah, <sighs> Hannah's been missing since yesterday. Decided to check out the neighbor's apartment yourself. You cost into your neighbor's kitchen. You are shocked to see countless dress filled with eels floating around endlessly. Where is Kana? Someone by your neighbor is running away. His eyes are missing with countless any blood and took some stuff from me. Oh gosh. I can't stand when I just lose something like that. I'm like, I could I'm gonna die if it keeps happening. Oh, kind of. I found the neighbor. When his eye burst, I slipped on the blood and lost consciousness. I'm afraid there's something in my eye now too. Oh, oh God. Oh God. You want me to? Are you okay? Kind of, uh, it's fine. It's fine. You're fine. I know. You're fine. You're fine. I, I'm doing a good thing here. Oh, we got to do you've been sitting for over three hours. You gotta go up your uh, eyes to see your friend. Kind of wearing an eye patch. Not so pretty anymore, eh? I can't exactly tell the doctor's truth about what happened. I'm pretty sure I won't be winking my left eye anytime soon. But thank you for saving my life. Oh, you're okay. That w that makes me super uncomfortable. I hate stuff with like a needle going to the eye. But well, you know, she looks pretty good for the most part. Yeah, yeah you know, I like the look. Oh, God. I, is this like another option or just blank out because there's nothing I can do? And she's good! You still processing the van, sitting with your friend Kana for you, problem building, watch police officers emptying out your neighbor's place. Oh my god. And for the worst, you're stuck with everything up, making it harder for, to, for you to find what you want. Okay. I'm gonna stop here. I'm gonna stop here. I'm not the best on health or reason right now. Like, I'm actually quite low. Kana's a permanent ally for me right now. Look at her. Did you hear that? Never mind. You know, she says that, but she's good for the most part. But yeah. Um, I don't have the highest reason nor stamina at the moment. I think I might be able to actually win on this run. I don't know how to win this game. I'm assuming you just go to the lighthouse and fight stuff until you get to the thing and fight a god or something. Uh, so yeah, I think I'd be able to beat this game. Like, I have Kana on my side now, who's actually a really good ally. I have really powerful weapons, the mask. Like, I have really good stuff. Uh, I just don't want this corner to go too long, I've been recording for like two hours after this. <laughs> but yeah, I can see myself actually beating this uh, down the line. So. Oh, man, that was just so creepy. I love this game, though. This game's so interesting to me. I want to beat it because it's so cool. But anyway, hope you guys sincerely enjoyed this video. This was Koi Maizu, and don't you dare go hollow.